Hello YouTube and welcome to Review Mars and today we are going to discuss about Kangen water ionizer. What exactly is a Kangen water ionizer? What is the difference between a water purifier and a water ionizer? Do you really need a Kangen water ionizer? So if you want to know all these answers, please stay down to the video and watch the entire video so that you'll understand what exactly is the ionizer and friends please like the video please subscribe to my channels let us see if we can get at least 20 likes on this video so let's get started my friends first of all friends i like to tell you something about our body our body consists of almost 70 percent of water water is the essence of our lives friends and almost our body is having 80 percent of water 70 percent of water inside so whatever we drink is very essential to our body. So do we really need an alkalizer for our body? So friends, the basic of science says that anything that is either acidic or alkaline. So the cancerous cells or other bacteria that are more prone to survive in a acidic type of environment. So if you you are drinking water, we, what is the source of water to our home friends? We get water from the municipal corporations and the water travels from various rivers and dams and then it comes to the pipelines that is age of old and it is having rusted from inside and we after that it goes to the filtration plants of the municipal corporations there the people put chlorine and all other dangerous chemicals to just purify the water and at the end of the day what happens the water comes to your tap after the tap it before that it comes it goes into the storage tanks of your society or of your buildings the storage tanks we don't know whether they are cleaned regularly or not so what at the end of the day what happens we get almost after that we purify the water but what happens to the water in this entire process in this entire journey the water gets almost more acidic in nature than it was rather before so what happens in an acidic environment the cells of cancer the other bacteria are more prone to grow or more prone to sustain so what is essential what is required is that if you want to stop these things if you want the cancerous cells not to grow so what you can do is you can drink alkaline water friends alkaline water i'll tell you the difference we when we get a neutral water that is a ph having seven anything that is ph that is having greater than seven anything that is having ph greater than seven is considered as alkaline and anything that is having low ph than seven that it's considered as acidic friends so what is the method to bring alkaline water to you friends yes that is the process of ionization that is used by the alkaline water purifier uh, water ionizers that is that is the basic principle that they alkaline the water that you drink so friends if you drink bottled water friends what happens with the bottled water you're purchasing a bottled water from a local retailer stores and the, before you get the water it has been traveling ever since from the production till the consumers and what happens it exposed to great heats outside temperatures high heat sunlight direct sunlight and what happens the plastic containers my friends they are very much dangerous they release some carcinogenic chemicals into the water and that water you drink and after that you get sick you get cancers if you drink too much of bottled water friends yes this happens friends and uh, what is the reason friends because heat acts as a reason for the plastic to excrete some chemicals into the water so it is not advisable to drink more of bottled water friends most of the american people consume bottled uh, sodas and other carbonated beverages so even carbonated beverages also friends they are too much of acidic and they increase the acidity levels in your body and you can get prone to get cancers and other bacterial infections more easily rather than if you drink more of alkaline water friend so kangen water water ionizes what it does it ionizes you water it ionizes your water and provides you more of alkaline level water if you see the alkaline level of the water that is ionized by kangen it will be more than uh, 10 and 11 if you'll drink what if you'll go and check the water ph levels of water that is drained from himalayan ranges you'll find the alkalinity of high levels of alkaline water so that's why people who stay used to say saints who used to stay at himalayas and they used to drink the water that is draining down the rivers and the stream waters they used to have enormous 
health and enormous life they used to sustain almost hundreds of years that was the basic reason that they used to drink highest level of alkaline water so they used to have more good health so yes friends alkaline water is a basic concept behind good health if you want to sustain your health you should have alkaline water 80 percent of all illness can exist only in acidic environments so yes you need to have alkaline water what does an alkalinizer do with the water actually it is a simple technology that increases the ORP of the water. ORP stands for oxidation redemption potential. It is directly linked to the charges of the water. The, uh, sub, the, the substance which are having positively charged are acidic and where the substance which are negatively charged are alkaline. So what does the ionizer does? It charges your water with negative charge and yes you get a lower a negative ORP if you're having a negative ORP that is a good thing friends try to understand if you're having a positive ORP that is the water is acidic and if you're having a negative level ORP anything below zero is good for your health regards to ORP friends if you are drinking negative ORP water that is more good for your health friends and it it helps to fight tremendous other carcinogenic properties of the cells it also reduces the risk of getting cancers if you're drinking more of a negative ORP water friends and yes and water ionizer does reduces the negativeness of the ORP to a great extent and that is proven friends so yes uh, the Kangen water ionizer does really affects the ionization process does really affect the ORP to reduce it to a great extent and yes that alkalizes your water and this it's good for your health if you'll drink a negative ORP water then you are going to sustain more friends this is the basic science I'll tell you sir the ionization process itself helps the water divided into two parts the acidic water and alkaline water the acidic water is drained down or you can use the acidic water to different purposes also and the alkaline water you get as a free uh, as a drinkable water sources and yes that water can be stored and you can drink that water to be healthy friends hope i i hope that you have liked my video let's see if we can get maximum likes to this video please subscribe to my channel friends and i'll be bringing you daily such kind of informative videos about water purifier technologies and everything everything next video will be about what is the difference between water ionizer and water purifier that is our water purifier and water ionizer or Kangen water purifier versus our water purifier so friends let's stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe thank you very much friends